Welcome to our full resolution troubleshooting steps for your Alienware computer. Check if the keyboard works on a different port. Disconnect the USB interface from the current USB port and connect it to a different port on the computer. Is the keyboard responsive to input? If no, let's continue to the next step. To test the keyboard by loading the BIOS setting page, restart the computer. Repeatedly tap the F2 key at the Dell logo screen to enter BIOS. Check if you were able to access the BIOS. If you were unable to access the BIOS, let's move on to the next step. To boot into safe mode, go to start and select settings. Select update and security. Navigate to recovery and click on restart now. After your PC restarts, select Troubleshoot on the Choose an Option screen. Choose Advanced Options. Select Startup Settings and click on Restart. After your system restarts, press F4 to enable Safe Mode. Is the keyboard responsive to input? If no, let's try this next step. To run a clean boot, Windows search MS Config. Click on System Configuration. Check Selective Startup. Uncheck Load Startup Items. Go to the Services tab and click on Hide All Microsoft Services. Select Disable All. Click OK. Restart your system. Revert the process when you're done testing. If you were unable to type in the Windows search bar, continue to the next step. To check the on-screen keyboard, restart the computer. On the sign-in screen, click on the Ease of Access Center icon. Select on-screen keyboard. Check if the system reacts to any input from the on-screen keyboard. If the system didn't react to any input, let's try the next step. To update the system BIOS, Windows search and select BitLocker. Click on Suspend Protection and Confirm. Go to www.dell.com slash support. Click on Detect PC. Select Drivers and Downloads. Set BIOS as a category. Download the latest update and run the executable file. Click OK to confirm the update and follow the on-screen instructions to complete the process. If you are updating the BIOS on a laptop, please make sure the battery is present and the AC adapter is plugged in. Are you still having keyboard issues? If yes, let's move on to the following step. To uninstall and then reinstall the keyboard drivers, Right-click the Start button and select Device Manager. Expand the Keyboard section. Right-click the keyboard you wish to repair and click on Uninstall. Click on Scan for Hardware Changes.
Windows will now detect your keyboard and automatically install the driver. If you're still experiencing keyboard issues, please let us know so we can provide additional assistance.